another. It's also gorgeous. But we're we're now going to have a look from the Digby Bijou range, which we've had here for nearly three years. Mm -hmm. Anniversary coming up it's shortly. Coming up. That's I right. believe where <laughs> that time went. And you've been loving it for that period of time. But um, our team from Digby Bijou is not back now until March. So this is your opportunity now to get your lovely pieces while you can. Also for Valentine's Day. This is very lovely. important. Look at this. It's almost uh, mystical. It's when you look in this one here. Very unusual. Look, that's, that's the, incredible. That's the that superstar stone. of all the crystals. That's our Aurora Borealis. Oh. And it's a fantastic uh, stone. All the colours under the sun are in, are in that one crystal. And we've got pinks. It's, it's actually a very girly piece of jewellery because pink is obviously flirty. It's, it's very, hmm, very fun. It's a very, uh, there's a lot of fantasy in this. And it's quite big, big stones. And a different cut. It's a Rivoli cut. And they look a bit like, if you can see in the, the bezel setting, they have um, well, like the little uh, pyramids or like uh, we call rondavels. I mean, I'm, I've got relatives in South Africa. And and I spent many holidays there. And we stayed in these little rondavels. They're like little cottages, round huts. Happy times. Mm -hmm. And pink is a very happy color. They don't say pretty in pink for nothing, do no. they? And it's a very and it's a rose gold feminine. color of the metal, yes. isn't it? So you've got a really nice tinge of rose gold to it too. So if you love pretties, then I think the rose gold with the beautiful pinks works it's so well together. Isn't this one here is just quite tone. fascinating. Oh, this the aurora 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 it's like um, <laughs> it's like there's a layer of this beautiful crystal on the top, uh -huh. but then when you look deep into it, it's it's almost as if there's like there's the no purple, bottom to blue. it. There's so much oh, depth to it. I see some green. They they glisten and sparkle in every color and then we've got the nice fuchsia next to it we've got light rose and rose we've got four different colors great length as well and tennis bracelets are very staple there there's never too much you can always wear them whatever the occasion and I think a lot of tennis stars wear them just obviously because they're like talisman mm. and, uh, and there you've got your um, fastening there yeah. so it's easy the tennis bracelet it? came from was it Chris Everett? It was Chris Everett. Yeah, she, she had, had a uh, she was in the given U.S. final in I think it was in 1987, and she wore a diamond link bracelet which broke, so they had to interrupt the match, uh -huh. and she was allowed to get all her diamonds, and the photographers were obviously taking oh, pictures. Oh, it's okay. going around the world, so a new new jewelry trend was born: the tennis bracelet, and. Uh, they, ah. they hit or they took off like the rocket to the moon, and I can understand yeah. why because they're very, they're so wearable. You can wear it with your jeans. You can wear it with very simple clothes. You know, with we can wear it obviously for great occasions. And these colors, they're they're very. Um, I think they're just very funky, and they will make you make you just forget the. They beat the winter blues. Definitely. I don't think you can yeah, say it any that. better. And <laughs> under forty pounds is thirty nine pounds and twenty five pence, and the length of that is a length of twenty and a half centimeters in length. It's three three six two seven oh. Let's give you a